People in Ithaca are trying to get back to a sense of normalcy, going back to the restaurants and shopping on the commons. But just feet away, a historic building lay in ruins right in the heart of the city. But you really just can't prepare yourself for an 18-wheeler inside of a restaurant that you're very familiar with. Just three days ago, this was the scene after a tractor-trailer truck crashed into the Simeon's restaurant, injuring at least seven and claiming the life of 27-year-old Amanda Bush, a bartender who was inside at the time of the accident. For over 135 years, this building has been a staple in Ithaca. It's become one of the busiest corners. And now this corner is the site of a memorial as people gather to pay their respects to a local favorite and the life lost inside. Well, it's a much calmer night tonight on the Commons compared to Friday. As you can see, a protective fence has been set up around the restaurant and a memorial has been put in place for the 27-year-old bartender who lost her life that night. She leaves behind a 14-month-old baby. Well, it's sort of like the, uh, you know, the the very fragile state of mortality, right? You can be here today, gone tomorrow. Tom Herschel and his family ate at Simeon's restaurant just days before the accident. Amanda was their server. She was really nice to us, and I was, that, was the first, that was one of the first things that we thought of as soon as we heard about it was, uh, oh, I hope she's okay, I hope the people there are okay. They didn't realize until they saw the memorial that their server was the one killed in the accident. We just actually, we walked over there and found out when we looked at the photo, um, and that was pretty upsetting. I mean, it makes you think these little decisions that you make where you decide to eat, where, where you sit down, and you have no control over what's going to happen.